if there was a Mario cook book. And it said how to cook Mario. Is it ethical to eat Mario? Yeah. Yes. I mean, if you can eat a person, then... What I want to know is if you if you ate Mario, would it be cannibalism? Oh, no. The book goes into detail on how to, like, truss up his little body. <laughs> Remove the head from the stem. <laughs> I put him in the stew and then it goes... <laughs> put Mario in the pot until he stops screaming. When Mario stops saying, Mama! He's about done. Actually, <laughs> in pain. That's just air escaping. It really feels like I'm making a stand here because I'm letting Mario die over and over. You're all talking about like trussing up Mario like a turkey, and I'm eating a chili top. <laughs> okay, I know that I I know that I was leading into this by being like, "Hey, is, would it be cannibalism to eat a Mario?" He he he, and then all y'all were like, "Oh uh, yeah, we're gonna crack open Mario's bones and suck the marrow from the world. It's like sitting here going, "Jesus Christ!" We call this part of the body the marrow yo yo. Marrow yo yo. Did y'all expect this? Today, I sure did. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Bing Drew Babish, and today we're going to prepare the Marvel Morte. The Marvel Morte. <laughs> So you're gonna want to trust Mario's legs up like this. This will prevent um, the juices from. Make sure all this blood goes to his head before it's coming off. Now you little bing bong babish. This is becoming cringing with babish. <laughs>